Well, I don't have my camera gear at the moment here, so we'll do a one-handed video. Um, putting the Sprite extruder wiring into a Creality Ender 3. And this is also good for the CR10. And actually, I think I'm going to be using on, on a few other printers I have just because you know you got that 2020 rail uh, you should be able to put this on just about any printer that you know uses the old style plug-in connectors you know some of the new boards they're just running ribbons straight out of the board you know which is great for proprietary uh, reasons but doesn't help the end user out very much this was not very difficult. Pull the old stuff off, put the new stuff in, you know. Uh, your fan goes in here, your heater. Uh, there was a fan connector there, your thermistor. Uh, pretty simple. Your um, extruder plugs in there. So was not all that difficult. <laughs> This is what it looks like on the printer. I gotta, uh, I gotta make my belt a little bit longer because I had this originally on a four-wheel carriage, but I gotta, I gotta just cut a new piece of belt for that. So we'll get the uh, sprite running on the Ender Three. Like I said, I mean any printer with a 2020 rail. Should be able to put this on. I got uh, some Arion Thinker printers, and you know, you also got the Sunlu S8. There's a few printers that uh, you can put this on. Maybe my Mingda D2. I gotta see <laughs> see what that board looks like. There's definitely a possibility to get this running on many printers besides just the Ender CR10 so uh, definitely looking forward to that I got three of these on order this is the first one I got in from Amazon so I think uh, I think we'll be in good shape with this hopefully I can kick out some real high quality prints that you guys are n know me for uh, pretty simple mounting up here on four screws I put some washers behind here not necessary but I don't have auto leveling really don't like auto leveling um, but there is a bracket for that and there is a wiring for that also in the cable this fan I know some people have changed out but I'm going to try the stock fan for now if I got any issues I'll just uh print up one of the upgraded larger fans but we'll give this a shot first you know I always like to keep things as an out of the box experience this is the first uh, time I've touched this printer in a long time it was was kind of mothballed but uh, you know I, I keep my printers as much as possible stock machines this still has the single Z drive you know, it's it's old school. Take care. Happy printing. Not a commercial for a sun kiss. So you know, don't don't kick my post out here. Let me let me block it out of the way. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm talking about. Take care. Happy printing. <laughs>